Today we ask the age-old question, will a jack-o'-lantern? Let's find out. Good mythical morning. Mythical beast, please direct your attention to the center of the screen where we have a traditional jack-o'-lantern. Well, it's traditional in the sense that it's a pumpkin. It's pretty cool in the fact that it's a Rhett and Link pumpkin. Yeah, Thank is. you, Morgan, for carving that. But you know what we've concluded? We've concluded that pumpkins are so 2013. <laughs> and we're going to up the ante. And I did a little bit of boop, boop, boop research, and I found out that jack-o'-lanterns originated in Ireland. The rumor has it that they did, and that they used to use turnips and beets. Huh. So there's a precedent for using things other than pumpkins. Can't beat that, let's turn it up. <laughs> oh! Okay, we're gonna answer and ask, Will it jack o <laughs> We've got some alternatives to pumpkins that we are going to o'lantern and decide if, if we've been too narrow in our scope all these years, pagan people, or whoever <laughs> celebrates Halloween. <laughs> I celebrate Halloween. Um, oh, what are we starting with? Oh my goodness. <laughs> We're starting let with that slide. Aquamelon. Will, Will it jack o' lantern? Traditionally known as watermelon. Uh, this typically is uh, harvested in the summer, but uh, we live in an industrialized farming culture now where we can get anything in any season. <laughs> any time. Thank you for that. And I want to admit right now, I've never carved a, a jack o' lantern. Ever. Never carved one. This is the first time I will insert a knife into a fruit, right here. What? I've never carved a jack-o'-lantern. My wife believes in just setting out pumpkins, just, you know, like three or four pumpkins of different sizes. She didn't want to carve them. She's in charge. Okay, so listen, um, we're each gonna try her on and then we're gonna ask the question. You've already started, but I can quickly catch up because I have done this before. It's not a race though, it's just a, it's, we're gonna determine A, will a jack-o'-lantern, and B, who's got a better jack-o'-lantern. Maybe I should start on the side. I guess this is a melon-o'-lantern. What are we calling this, water-lantern? If it doesn't work, we're not calling it anything. And then Let's what see, do you do? Just start digging out of here? I think I need this. And then you eat it? Oh, wow. Do you have to eat all of the, in the contents? <laughs> it's gonna take a while. Whoops. I've already made a rash decision. <laughs> <laughs> Wow. Was that intentional? No. Oh. Just... Boy, there's a lot of water in watermelon. Look at this. I feel like I'm at a resort. All right. I'm just afraid I'm going <laughs> to cut myself or someone around me. Preferably someone around me. Making a little bit of a weird noise. I apologize. All right. So now all, all of you who all of those of you who are not in medical school currently. I got a that. can down here if you're wondering. Link, link. Oh wow, you've cored it. Look at the water in the watermelon. I mean, they call it that for a reason. Why? Link, look. It's called watermelon. Why are you so amazed? <laughs> All right, here yeah, we, we go. We've never done that. Now, there's not a lot of risk of this thing uh, collapsing on itself. You're going in from a, an interesting angle. Oh, oh, did you see that? <laughs> no. <laughs> All right, I saw my dad carve jack-o'-lanterns as a child. And he would use one Except big before he knife. Deserted you? One big, <laughs> one big <laughs> knife. Uh, I don't remember this kind of contraption, but jack o' lanterns have really gotten more complex since my childhood. So you're already in face zone. I'm going for something special here. Hmm. Doing some eyebrows. Doing a little wink o' lantern. <laughs> Whoops! <laughs> you having trouble over there? Uh oh, my nose is a little low. Uh, maybe it's my mouth now. <laughs> oh yeah, pumpkin master. I'm the pumpkin master. <laughs> I think eyebrows work. Okay, okay, there. okay, okay. I'm removing the mouth. Oh look at, look at. Oh, oh, oh. It looks like a weird letter that doesn't exist. What is that? A W? I don't know. All right, Link. Let's wipe them down. And uh, let's insert our lights, and then we will turn it around and see if we've got a jack-o'-lantern. I'm gonna put my top back on here, and then we turn around and the lights go out. Three, two, two one. one. Mmm, mine looks better than yours. Yours looks like it has some sort of physical malady. Oh, it's sharp too. How? Oh, oh, look at that. Here we go. I'm gonna put a different Oop. light in there. Oh, that's not gonna do anything for you. Oh yeah, there you go. See the pink? You see what I intended? 
<laughs> no. I gotta admit, yours is pretty good, Link. Will it jack-o'-lantern? Yes! yes, of course. Okay. No surprises here. Um, yeah, we knew that was gonna happen. I mean, it's a freaking melon. But uh, I'm not really into the low carb movement and uh, they've made bowls out of bread. I enjoy those at Panera. <laughs> not, what? not a sponsor. Why not bread a lantern? <laughs> Will, Will it jack a lantern? This is gonna take a little strategy. Oh, you're going right through the front? What do you think I should do? You're making me nervous I, now. I think you should probably go the traditional route of hollowing it out. Hmm. At least that's what I'm gonna try. <laughs> it's really not as hard as I'm making it look. I'm like, oh man, it's like cutting a tree. Yours seems like it's harder than mine. Boy, I'm gonna make a bread glove before I make a <laughs> bread o' lantern. All this bread's gonna soak up that water from the melon. You're wasting everything. You should eat a little bit of the insides, man. It's so good. All right, I ate a little bit of the inside. Inside bread is the best bread. Unless you're a crust man. Any crust people in the house? You want some? I got bread balls. Now don't go with too much gusto or you'll pop through prematurely there. Put that on that t-shirt. <laughs> you don't want your finger to pop through there where the eye shouldn't be. Um, bread's a lot more uh, pliable than I would have first thought. Yeah, this is a canvas just waiting Gosh. to be a lantern. I mean, it feels so good in there too. Okay, so I gotta figure out what kind of face I want on this puppy. Well, that was pretty, your last face was really advanced. This is interesting. Mm. The structural integrity of uh, uh -oh. this bread bowl is questionable. <laughs> so far, so stupid. Look at that. I mean, that, oh wow, okay, that's what you're doing. Go with it. <laughs> it looks good, man. I feel like we're in total lantern territory here. This is gonna catch on, man. It's like bread surgery. If bread ever gets injured, don't call us. <laughs> hmm. I'm done, but I'm not necessarily happy with how I finished. The good okay. part is you can kind of mold it. Oh gosh. Whoa. <laughs> you ever heard of a nose, dude? Are you nosing it or It's not? an emoji, man. Oh. All right, mine's ready, except for the light. I'm just gonna hold mine. I'm really happy with mine. All right, let me put the top on here. Okay, she's she's ready. That's she, huh? <laughs> Three, right. two. Bring the lights down. You have one sad looking piece of bread. <laughs> how, how does mine look? I can't see mine. Mine's an emoji. Oh, there we go. It's a sad face emoji. Oh, I don't like Halloween, because nobody eats bread on Halloween. Everybody eats candy and mm. pumpkins. Mine, I tried to go with a smile I did in middle school Let for me my see. school portrait. Like, hey. Yeah. It's pretty cool, but mine's better this round. Yeah, I mean, yours is falling apart. Mine's bigger, mine's sadder. Uh, so will bread jack-o'-lantern? Yes. yes. So they can make a little mini burger work. with this. It has nothing to do with lanterns. Though. But I'll tell you what might have to do with a lantern. Uh, that didn't make any sense. Chicken. Whole chicken. Will, Will it jack-o'-lantern? I have reason to believe that we can lantern these things. But well, there is a cavity in there. Right, so now it's just our job to hmm, lantern them. Now, I have an idea to use, I've got this can of drink here. So I'm gonna put this in my chicken to, I'm gonna to, begin. to preserve the Oh my goodness, I'm glad that chicken's dead. Because <laughs> he would be having a very unpleasant experience right about now. Oh man, first of all, I've already, the legs have separated. Maybe I won't do that. That's already happened. Maybe I won't do that. Let's forget that ever happened. Okay. Oh, you're just cutting right through the breast, huh? Mm. Well, here's this part of the chicken. Probably shouldn't have come off, but it did. And there it is. <laughs> I'll just do that with the other side too. Here's some more chicken that's not gonna benefit my cause. Wow. Hmm. I think that, oh my god. Look goodness. at that chicken staring at you right out of his nipples. Oh, that's freaky. Now, do you see what I see? That's the mouth of a creepy demon. Like, if I just add eyes, all of a sudden we've got the creepiest O lantern. I've got to break through to the cavity. Like, <gasps> I suck your soul dry. All right, here we go. Okay. All I gotta do is get a little light to come through. I broke through to the cavity. 
This chicken is being honored. When I die, I want to be old lantern. You know what? <laughs> I need I need that. I got bones I got to get need out of here. Need a drill here. bit. I'm going to use this, even though that's probably wrong-minded. Oh, oh. Okay. Hey, check this out. It's like the mouth of the thing. Oh, wow. Here we go. Oh man, this is, oh yes. Yeah, I can almost see this happening. Success is happening. <laughs> oh wow, right? Yes, yeah, you jealous over there? <laughs> you jealous of my chicken? I mean, I really feel like I'm almost done. Okay, hey y'all, get your Pinterest boards ready. Cause some something good's about to jump out at y'all. <laughs> I'm telling you, chicken. Oh, lantern. Oh man. Okay, I feel like I've got light. I've got light inside this chicken body. <sighs> what in the world? I'm clearing the passage. Got to get my light my light holes in this chicken. <laughs> this chicken never knew it was gonna have light holes in it. I think I'm ready. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna beta test. Oh, my light's going out. I think I might be able to get this light back in, like my bread light. I'm gonna need all the room I can get, Mr. Chicken. I mean, it's all the way there. I think it will once we go totally dark. Okay, I think I'm ready to present my, my chicken, my meat lantern Okay, all right, here we go. Three, two, one. Oh, you can see your light. Go, let's go even dimmer. Go all the way, go dark. See, you can tell I've got two eyes and a mouth here. Now, hold on, let's bring the, let's bring the oh, light. Look, look, here we go. Yeah, this see? is blue, huh? Yeah, it's a different color light. It's like an owl lurking in the But dark. I really need the lights on to demonstrate let's my let's, talking technique. Yeah, let's turn the lights back look, on. It's a double. Hmm? Oh. Hey, hey, let me out of here. Now that's pretty creepy, but l look at mine though. Look at this. <gasps> That is scary, Link. Mine looks almost like it might be happy. Look and at that. Like, he decided to talk. Look, see, this is his mouth. Brah, brah. And these are his eyes. I'm looking at you, I'm looking at you. Put this on Pinterest. Rah. But there's no light. So I think let's let's just go ahead and uh, put the verdict down. Will it jack-o'-lantern? No. <laughs> Feel free to give it a shot for yourself. I'm sure you can uh, build on what we've done. Thanks for liking and commenting on this video. Remember, you can support the show by checking out lynda.com slash rhett and link home to thousands of online video tutorials. <gasps> Learn how to do video editing, photo, you name it. Check it out, lynda.com slash rhett and link for a free trial. You know what time it is. I'm John. I'm Dan from York, Pennsylvania. And it's time to spin the wheel of mythicality. We want to let you know that Nerdist and Geek and Sundry are curating a whole week's worth of Halloween content. It's called Hallow Week. It includes a vampire web series, all new vampire web series, and a Felicia Day music video. Links in the description. Check that out. Also, click through to Good Mythical More, where we ask the question, will it jack-o'-lantern for two other items? Boiled eggs and potatoes? Try to explain the bits and the bees. <laughs> I brought the eggs. Did you bring the bits and the bees? Ah, uh, well, I've got some bits of bread and some chicken bits. Uh, can, hold on, let me see where the chicken's bits are. And so, okay, now we explain to them, class, uh, there, there are no birds involved, first of all. Well, the chicken bits were somewhere down here, but I think I ate them. <laughs> uh, but all I can say is that somehow, yeah, the, they, they, well, happens. the bee, the bees yeah. uh, sting. Swarm. The bees swarm. The bees swarm. swarm, and then they sting, and and then the chicken's like, "Hey, here's my bits." And then there's two eggs. Oh, it's really smelling like sulfur over there. Just so you know, oh. sulfur so good. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really full of that crap. Today. Oh yeah, crap is a good word for it.